New at 6, a safety warning in Baldwin County tonight. A Georgia woman is speaking out about the devastating injury she suffered stepping into an uncovered hole in the beach while visiting Fort Morgan. NBC 15's Corey Pippen is in Baldwin County tonight with the message the woman hopes all beachgoers will heed. Sally Dixon's broken leg came from a deep hole dug on a Fort Morgan beach. Now she's bedridden with mounting hospital bills and wants to try to prevent this from happening again. We all know that people like to walk on the beach at night. We all know that kids love to run with their parents and look for shells. Sally Dixon is speaking out tonight, hoping to keep this from happening to anyone else. These are pictures of Dixon's surgically repaired left leg after what was supposed to be a fun trip with her sisters in Fort Morgan on August 21st. It was our first night. We we're just about to wrap it up and go to bed for the night. And I thought, well, I haven't dipped my toes in the water yet. Dixon, who was visiting from Atlanta, Georgia, says she and her sister Candy made their way down to the water to do just that. I turned around to head back to the to the beach house and all of a sudden I just dropped. My left leg actually went knee deep down into a hole and so my body kept going forward. I was so shocked I didn't really know what was happening. Dixon says her sister called 911 and she was rushed to the ER where she found out she had a tibia plateau fracture or a break of the larger leg bone just below the knee required four days in the hospital. I ended up having a plate and four screws uh, inserted I can have no weight bearing on my leg at all for six to eight weeks. I've had to take short term disability. Meanwhile, Dixon says the ambulance ride and hospital stay could cost her nearly $20,000 out of pocket after health insurance. She posted her experience on Facebook, encouraging others who may not know better to consider the dangers. I even put a hashtag fill your holes because uh, I thought something's got to be done. People need to know that they can cause real damage to other people. Dixon would also like to see large signs at beach entrances urging people not to leave holes in the sand. She hopes to come back here next summer with her sisters for the trip they missed out on this year. In Baldwin County tonight, I'm Corey Pippen, NBC 15 News.